and I'm Anna. Whoa. It's the time to read the book about teamwork. This is the team. Teamwork. So this is Matthew and this is his mom. Matthew said his mother, you are drawing all the time. You need to play sports. Sports are good for you. Matthew drew a picture of a purple Tyrannosaurus. Look at this. Matthew said his father, you need to play sports. Sports are good for you. Sports teach you teamwork. Matthew drew a green sky behind the purple Tyrannosaurus. <laughs> Matthew said his father, pay attention. Matthew drew a yellow bird in the green sky behind the purple Tyrannosaurus. That's it, said his mother. She put him in the car, drove him to the park, and signed him up for baseball. The coach gave Matthew a cap and a big glove and put him in right field. A ball flew over Matthew's head, but he didn't move. The other player yelled, Matthew, pay attention! Ooh, a ball flew by Matthew's foot. He drew a sunset on his shirt. <laughs> the other players yelled, Matthew, pay attention! A ball flew by Matthew's ear. He drew a yellow stegosaurus on his shoe. The other players yelled, Matthew, pay attention! Finally, a ball flew out and landed right in Matthew's glove and he didn't even have to move to get it. Look at this, said Matthew. A plain white ball. He drew a picture of the coach on the ball. <laughs> hey, yelled the other players. Three back! So Matthew threw the ball back to the catcher. Threw it back to the catcher. Wow, said the catcher. And he came out to right field. Matthew drew a giant and a unicorn on his uniform. The catcher gave him another ball. <laughs> and Matthew drew a yellow and green monster on it. Here. Soon, all the balls had drawings on them and everyone was throwing them back and forth, looking at the pictures. All the balls has pictures. Wow, said the coach. What a team. Look at them throw. That's amazing. Then the pitcher th threw a ball to the coach. It was the one with his picture on it. Oh, here. <laughs> In the picture, 
He had a large purple pimple on his nose. <laughs> Yikes! Said the coach. What's going on? <laughs> Everybody's laughing. It's Matthew! Everyone yelled. The coach looked at all the balls and he looked at Matthew. He threw a ball to him. Oh, bounce! It hit Matthew in the head and he didn't move. <laughs> hmm, said the coach. The coach walked out to right field and said, Matthew, you have to really figure out how to make this team work. Okay. But right field is not a good place for you. Where are you. Where are we going to put you? I could be team artist, Matthew said. And he drew a purple Coachosaurus on the coach's uniform. <laughs> what kind of dinosaur? Coachosaurus. Cool. Yay! Say the other players, three cheers for Matthew. <laughs> Oh, wow, a lot of pictures on their shirts. Look. <laughs> the end. That's it for this book. What did we learn? We learned that even if you are not good at something, there is something else you are good at that other people will appreciate. Oh yeah, lots of kids love dinosaurs. So from this book, we, uh, we read two kinds of dinosaurs. One is Tyrannosaurus. Another one is Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. So I check it from internet. I'm gonna show you some picture of the T-Rex. This is the T-Rex Tyrannosaurus. Wow, look at the look at the the the, the, the skin. Look like a zebra. <laughs> it's so big. And then this is the Stegosaurus. Wow. Look at those beautiful plates. Are they called plates? And you see, there is a, um, this is a human being. Maybe, oh, here, this is the large Stegosaurus compared to a 1.8 meter tall man. Look at this. The dinosaur is much bigger than a human being, and this one too. And then, I want to see, oh, this one. Wow, see how big is this dinosaur? Stegosaurus. Ooh, and you can see all kinds of dinosaurs. And the smallest one is like this. smaller than a human being and there's another one can fly too wow look stegosaurus this one and uh, tyrannosaurus the t-rex look which one is bigger what do you think and the stegosaurus has a small head, small brain, and look at this 
Tyrannosaurus. It has a big head, and it seems taller than the Stegosaurus. Okay, that's a lot of information about dinosaur today. I'm gonna read you another book next time. Bye bye.